All right. Take a listen to this. A couple of months ago, we said the weather outside is frightful, but here we are at Hamcation. The weather outside is delightful. Ah, delightful. So is what's going on inside, Mike. How am I going to follow that up? <laughs> it's amazing. We're here at Hamcation in Florida. If, you know, I don't know. We may be the only snowbirds down here, but it's uh, here Toronto's going So Flex Radio is at Hamcation, okay? And they posted this video today. So I'm very, very excited because, well, at Dayton, they announced their new 8000 series with the biggest feature being adaptive pre-distortion. And they originally said it was going to be in the upgraded software that was supposed to come out August of 2025. They then said they never said that. And a recent video from about two months ago, maybe a little longer, um, one of their people said uh, that adaptive pre-distortion will be available late December 24, early January. Well, uh, we are at the end of the first week of February. So they're at Hamcation. This should be it. They should be announcing adaptive pre-distortion. Let's watch. Got the biggest snowstorm of the year coming up, but it's gorgeous here. So Flex Radio is here. We got yeah, it's a very of nice in here. Orlando. Got everything spread out. So let's go down. What do we got, Andy? Maestro C. Ah, very good, the Maestro. Look at this, Mike. 8400M. 80, 8400. Very cool. We've got these cool power supplies from PowerWorks. And really we have like a new power that. supply. Cool. Awesome. And they're USB addressable, so you can plug them in, see them on your computer, hmm. remote control on and off. Um, they got ton of power, ton of power pole connectors on them, plus uh, spade connectors, um, five-way binding. Let's fast forward back, a little. Let's get to the adaptive pre-distortion part. And those are manufactured by our partner, Rig X. Mm. This is the entry-level radio. Okay. Uh, if you're new to Flex Radio, you can upgrade. I highly recommend the 8400. Really good cost effectiveness. If you're just a rag chewer. Uh, Not a bad radio. You know, and it makes a great remote ra radio. And they might be announcing finally that the biggest feature that caused them to get so many orders at Dayton, Adaptive Pre-Distortion, hopefully this is it. We're about to hear about it. So you can expand on it later, throw a maestro on it, build out your whole, you know, put four monitors on your home computer. Very cool. Uh, two slices, 100 watts, 160 meters through to six meters. And you can be anywhere you want on the HF bands at any time with any of those two slices. And speaking of anywhere, um, let's both see. 8, this is a seven and a half minute video. Let's fast forward a little bit. We'll get to the good part, hopefully. GNS, and you'll be on. No. Time. These will work as network time protocol NTP. Okay, server. GPS so network time protocol. PC very back, cool. You're addition to that product and you know what it's not heavy if you have to ship it it's 16 pounds oh 16 pounds, pounds. cool Mike, you can you can uh, hike it up the mountain in the next soda dx yes really yes cool. and what about Moving imd any any flex 8600 oh maybe flex now they'll talk about it with one transmitter we go to four slices same deal four slices same gnss receiver very cool you can actually upgrade to a gps do if you really need a higher resolution both of them will do that uh, SO2R contesters, you'll know exactly what I mean. When yes, it says, yes. It is plug and play. I don't do too SO2R much SO2R contestation. anymore. Built-in uh, OTRSP for audio management. Good audio Built -in management. Built-in 60 dB bandpass filters. I have a video on YouTube showing and adaptive running, distortion? Uh, transmitting on 40 meters while listening on 20 meters. Wow. Where my 40 meter dipole is literally three feet below oh. the 20 meter antenna. I don't hear it. Just works. Seventh order pre-selectors. Oh. Yeah. Mike, what did you do here? I, th I heard order. I thought he was talking about third it. order and so maybe... The, uh, PowerWorks uh, power supply. Oh, uh, of course, a new it power supply. Or flat. Yes, it can we, sit uh, vertically and here. flat. Uh, it's got this cool display which shows you how much current you're drawing and a whole bunch of other... Uh, 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 wow, cool current okay, on a power supply. Can, awesome. configured, but there, I have seen them in the menu. Let's All right. Wait. Genius line. It's genius. Oh, wait. Hold on. If they're talking about the genius line, they're going to talk about amplifier. And the whole point of adaptive pre-distortion, when you're running that much power, is to clean up the signal where linearity is not possible and uh, keep you within your bandwidth. So if they're going to talk about the amplifier, maybe this is where they bring up, at least discuss it, adaptive pre-distortion and when they intend to release it. 
Because uh, remember, Dayton released the radio, 8,000 series. There were like multiple slides on finally having adaptive predistortion. Hopefully this is it. Let's listen. Same story. We have the 86M. Okay. The 86M, we get a front panel control uh, ready to go. I call it the picnic table radio like it's brother. The <laughs> That's so funny. Day. You can picnic take table. field day, put a battery on it, antenna, and you're on the air. Cool. All right. No internet required. Genius line it is amplifier. Genius. The power of Genius XL. This looks and feels as uh, it's built like a tank. Oh. You can carry it. Apparently, it fits and carry on luggage. Wow. So we've been told. Uh, it will run two radios at the same time. Yes. Two 8400s or yes. 6600. Okay. Which is a dual type function radio. There's an A and the B side. Awesome, you can Mike. Also use two OEM radios. Wow. Like Canwood.com, Yesu Ellicraft. Uh, or flex rate, you, so you can mix and match. It doesn't really matter. Uh, bandpass filters built in. And the adaptive be receiving pre-distortion works. The other radio How? Is transmitting. Full legal limit yeah. at 240 volt supply. Half legal limit at 120 volts. Excellent. Thank you. Wait, 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 wait. Mary, with that, it's wait. the Tuner Genius. Wait, you're on the Tuner Genius, but you just spoke about the amplifier. You spoke about the radios. There's really not much to talk about adaptive pre-distortion with the tuner. Okay, maybe, all right, everything's going to be okay. Maybe they'll circle back. Let's watch. Uh, it will run both band, both radios at the same time through it, or if there's a one by three model, which means one radio on one side and three antenna ports on the outside in case you need to switch up to three antennas. Uh, both of these work wonderfully in a remote situation as well. Cool. Speaking of antennas, if oh. you need more, uh, no. the Antenna Genius. Oh, Antenna Genius. Yep. Two outputs. So one to okay. one radio, one to another radio, or the pair, for example, to your 8600. Eight antennas. And the genius about all of this is the band information. The frequency information is all stored. So I'm very lazy with video editing, or I'd put Cricket's sound effect right now. In the heat of the moment, when you're contesting and you need to make a quick band change, yeah. you don't need all those sticky notes like I used to have on the monitors mm. that say, hey, remember to switch. Got it. This will take care of it for you. The 3 a.m. band changes with the amplifier going kaboom, problem goes away. Anything else, Andy? We're here till Sunday. We're here till Sunday. Let's talk a little bit about, about oh, previously loved radios. Oh, so used we, radios. We have a number of previously Trade loved radios. We have that. Gosh darn it, I thought it was they going to talk about adaptive pre-distortion. We, uh, we don't have any previously loved stock here at Orlando, but we can set you up. Um, Come see us. we got a minute uh, and a half left. Together for that. Uh, Come on. Also, before I forget, we've oh. got a genius tree mm. here. So, here. Good savings to be had there. Trades. Let's talk about trades for a moment. We, uh, we bring it all in. So if you have a flex rig that you'd like to trade in, yeah. trade up, come see us. We'll get your price. And so wait, if I have a 6,000 series, can I trade up to an 8,000 series to get adaptive pre-distortion? He's going to say it now, maybe. And if you happen to have something else, as long as it doesn't eat. That's what Richard says. That's what Richard says. We can set you up with a price on that as well. Okay. Yesu, okay. Kenwood, Icom, uh, um. what have you, amplifiers. Our partner is Maine Trading Company in Paris, Texas. Richard and Oh, Mike MTC, are great company, by the way. Both here this weekend. Richard can help you out with trade huh. uh, valuations on the spot. And if you're so inclined to bring it along, Richard will. Can I trade in an 8600 for an Apache Labs Anon with adaptive pre distortion? Or maybe a Hermes Light? Because. I'd walk away with cash after that trade-in, and I'd have adaptive pre-distortion. Huh. We'll trade it on the spot for you. We're very happy to have MTC as our partner here. Now, if I'm watching this on Facebook, and the trade-in program is just for a uh, U.S. Customer, oh, just for the U.S. Sorry, DJ. No Canada. Radio.com slash trade hyphen in. That'll Good. make sure we've got your deal associated with you, your call, and email. An adaptive okay. pre-distortion Thanks, will be Andy. available. Thank you, Mike. Thanks Wait. for you guys. Wait. Let me know if you saw this. You come to visit us. Where are you going? 
Lori says, what button do I push? The adapt the pre-distortion button. Push it. Boy, it got a little Show me how it there, works. It? Please. Guys. I told all of you a year ago, don't sell your 6,000. Right now, adapt the pre-distortion is vaporware. It is the main upgrade to the 8,000 radio. Yes, FPGA. Yes, faster computer. If you put a 6,000 and 8,000 next to each other in a contest, you're going to have the same experience. Where is the adaptive pre-distortion? This is the second major ham fest. Hopefully I'm wrong. Maybe more comes out this Sunday, but I bet after they watch this video, it will. Have a good night, guys. Take care.